When the Commanders went into Philadelphia on Monday night, nobody expected them to win. And the Commanders used that to fuel their upset victory. Now, going to Houston, the stakes aren't nearly as high, but most folks think the Commanders should win against the Texans. And Jack Del Rio is aware of how that could make Houston feel. And those that are disrespected are always scary because they all have talent. We all have talent. We know what it feels like to be disrespected. We were disrespected last week and have been quite a bit over the first start of this year. But it, it, it doesn't really matter because our focus is on our preparation. I think they've been in almost every single game they played in, too. Um, so that's just how the league works. you got to be ready and locked and loaded for every single week. I think you have letdowns when you um, don't come out with the same intensity and you, and you just expect your momentum from the last game to carry into the next one. That's just not how it works. The worst thing that we can do is go lay an egg on Sunday. So, again, we're just trying to keep the ball rolling, um, keep working hard. Because again, you know, the, the next game is the most important game. It's crazy to think where things stood for the Commanders just a month ago, or certainly two months ago. They started one and four, but in their last five games, they've climbed back to even on the season with a four and one record. Perhaps they figured out who they are. I feel like we always have an identity. I think we just kind of put everything together. You know, we played as a team, as a unit, you know. It wasn't just offense out there making plays, the defense, everybody kind of played as one whole. We weren't afraid of nothing. We knew what we had to do to prepare to, you know, go to Philly and play, you know, the Eagles. And we did what we had to do to you know, get the win. I feel like we just got to continue to, you know, you know, be unified and just stay together and we're going to be all right. Another day of practice and another day with no answers about Chase Young's status for Sunday. Considering it's Thursday and the game's in just a few days, it seems unlikely he gets on the field against the Texans. Washington has until next Wednesday to activate him off the injured reserve list. Covering the commanders in windy and cold Ashburn, I'm J.P. Finley.